Metallica quickly established themselves as the leading practitioners of the thrash sound, as much through their live shows as their records. But then, in 1986, with the band on the brink of greatness, disaster struck. There was also tragedy in rock this week. Metallica's bassist Cliff Burton was killed in a bus accident while the band was on tour in Sweden. He was 24. For a band as intense as Metallica, the death of Cliff Burton felt like losing a family member. Their response, though, came more in anger than sorrow, as new bassist Jason Newstead was to discover. Are you all still slightly in shock, do you think, and sort of taking it out on the new bass player? Because, I mean, that was an amazingly difficult role for somebody to step into. Yeah, yeah. There's no doubt that uh, there was a lot of hazing and there was a lot of grief that turned into spite towards Jason, that is pretty, pretty human, I would say. Uh, so again, when Cliff passed, you know, it was stuff the feelings and a lot of it came from drinking for sure. Uh, and then, uh, and the other part was just go play. That was, that's our other drug. It really is. You know, the world goes away when we play. There can be no bad. It just feels good. We're connected. It goes. It does. It goes away. <laughs>